where Zangief's command grabs are most effective. So it can be kind of scary. But like I said earlier, he Zangief doesn't have anything to wake up with until he has a level 2 super. So until he has a level 2 super, you can just kind of rush him down. And until you can get to the point of rushing him down, you can just kind of play this neutral. And her buttons are super, super strong. So like, like this, you can just kind of push him back. And there isn't a ton he can do about it. Besides be super patient. Maybe parry. He tried to larry that. I saw that. Oh, she pushed herself in the corner. Probably not the best idea to do the EX drill there. Because put herself in the corner. Now this is this game right there. Yep. Now this is where it gets really, really scary. Ooh, nice guess with the overhead. Oh, jumps out of the corner. Nice, nice. Now it's time for Cammy to pressure. Oh, that was a pretty good jump. Throw. There's throw still kind of scary for the Cammy. The good thing with the Cammy is just pushing forward and not letting the Zangief pull you off. And he just gets a grab. That just happens sometimes. That's good playing from the Zangief. He's really patient. Letting the Cammy kind of hang themselves. Has a really low GP. Oh, not GP. Dive kick. Ooh, random DP. Worked out though. But she kind of put herself in the corner again. Oh, another DFTP burnt out. That can be really scary against Keith because his headbutt, I think, is like plus six against a burned out person. So you gotta be super, super cautious. And just play really long range. Exactly what they're doing. They could probably whip punish that. Nice. Not as burnt out anymore. Not as much danger. I think I can start pushing the Zangief back again. I think you can drill that dive kick and punish it. He's doing a good job at keeping the Zangief at bay. Throws him towards the corner. Almost reached, almost. Ooh, that knee is so scary. He has full HP though, so he doesn't really have to worry that much about the grabs. But all she needs is like one more hit. Like that, exactly. But she didn't have to worry too much about command grabs at that point because the health lead was so big. Doing a little dance. Cam is slowly pushing deep. Oh wow, that's so far. Oh, good read. Oh, nice block. Yeah, this Cam is breaking under the pressure. One more hit will do it. He has so much to work with. He just needs a jab. Oh, it burns himself out. Oh, nice Larry. Nice Larry. Good reactions. Good job for the Zangief. Instant rematch. We'll see if the Cammy can get up. Oh, just throws afterwards. Sometimes it's going to be kind of hard when you get the EX that high to combo. you got to do a jab confirm. Oh, that has armor. That pushes so far. Oh, that's such a dope setup. Oh, we tried to guess the error. Tried to guess back him. But put, put, put him over the corner, though, which is not great. Now Cammy can just kind of pressure him. It's like he doesn't have any wake up options until he gets them. Oh my god! That was reactions. Yeah, he's kind of living pretty nice. Nice low, low light kick. I think he's playing great. Oh, nice cross up. Good combo, good combo. Oh, nice blocking time. Probably could have driven that with that. Super far range grab once again. Oh, that was a guess, yeah. Oh, didn't get the DP afterwards. Just a random drill, super punishable. That's gonna hurt, and she burnt out too. But everything's gonna be really plus, yeah, just like that. I think it's game over, pretty much. Oh! Got him, nice. Nice air throw. Good job, Zangief. Did really good against a pretty difficult matchup. Did exactly what he needed to do to keep the Zangief or to keep the Kami in line. Punished everything he should have punished and wasn't intimidated by Kami's very good normals. Those command grabs, those like command grabs are so far, you have to be so careful. Otherwise, you just can't loot, get, get wrecked. Waiting for the new players to get their stuff set up. Be curious to see what they're playing. That was a really, really good match.
And the jams in this game are so good. what they pick in a second. Mm. Like the stage select? No, oh, character select right here. Interesting. I think it was Jamie versus Dawson? I don't remember. I can't remember the first name already. I have a crap memory. <coughs> Chun Li. I heard Chun Li. Chun Li, extremely good, but kind of hard to play. Jamie versus Chun. Pretty interesting match. Jamie, not super great until he gets his drinks in. That can be kind of hard to do. Uh, Chun can have really good rush down, and her normals are super good. She has such a fast walk speed. Oh, nice combo. It's the first drink. Good combo from him. Oh, lightning kicks. Oh, wow. Lightning kicks and then just DP in. Okay, punishes though. That's another drink. Free drink. He gets a free drink off a of back throw, but not off a of forward throw. Oh, it's and Wow. Oh, Mr. Zen. Good throw. Doesn't go for the drink. Oh. Throws, but doesn't get punished. Hazanchu blocked. Oh. Whipping the heavy kick. Another punish on the overhead. Four drinks, and it's over. But now, loses all of his drinks, sadly. Has to work hard again for all those drinks. Oh, free drink off that. Oh, EX Fireball. Oh, nice confirm off the driver. Oh, drops the under. Pretty good block on the Havantri, but then he got tagged by the light kick. Oh, EX TP, just to stop him from pressuring. Another free drink. Two drinks means he has his dive kick now. Ooh, oh, that was a good punch kind of, but he didn't capitalize. Good air combo. The back throw, I see what pressure is. Oh, nothing too much on pressure. Three, that means he has a command grab now, which is super scary. Protects the throw. He keeps getting hit with these light, uh, kick lightning legs. He needs to be blocking low more. There's not really that much reason to be blocking high mid-screen like that. Good punish, gets a free drink. Another free drink from the low. Ooh, good block. Oh, driver right over. He's plus on that, so you gotta not push buttons after. Oh, that's pretty tricky. I haven't really seen him use his dive kick or his man grab yet. Which are very, very. Big moves. Oh, now he has, now he has all of the, all the juice. He's juicing. Tunley's already pretty low HP though, so. Oh, good punish. Ooh, oh, that broke it. That was crazy. Oh, he's anti air. Oh, nice, nice jab. Just jabbed him out of the sky. I think it's a shame he's doing a great job. Oh, it's random lightning leg, or spinning bird kick. Gets a back throw for the drink. Probably could have done a little bigger of a punish for the drink also, but you get what you can get, right? He hasn't used his command grab at all, or his dive kick. Pretty much he's not using any of the extra stuff he gets from drinking. Box is on gets a throw. Four throw, so no free drink. Ooh, big hit. Didn't think it was going to hit, so I didn't get a confirm. Oh, nice delay for the frame grab. His three drinks. Ooh, nice drive. Right? Oh, drops a combo, but then he just gets hit by the break dance at the end. Yeah. Ooh, nice. Drink, drink. Keep a little dranky drink. Ooh! Keeps getting caught by that. 
Get back throwing a drink. Nikki Culkin's really good for your pressure. It's so slow, you just kind of walk behind it and assert dominance. Oh, yes, DP, nice. He did get his fourth drink up. I think he was trying to prevent the fourth drink. Oh, he did the wrong enter for that. He did the drink enter instead of the damage enter. You can't remember, he's so hard to deal with when he has his drinks like that. It was 1 1. Now the winners fight each other. We'll see if the Zangief can beat the Jamie. That's a really, I think that's a kind of a tough matchup for Jamie. Especially without his drink. He might be able to drink for free if the Zangief isn't too aggressive. Otherwise, the, if you mess up your palms, your ruckus, he can just SPD you for free. Yeah, ah, no camera. So we'll see. It's going to be a pretty interesting matchup. We'll see. I don't think he can punish one Rekka. If he just does like a poke into one Rekka, it might not be SPDable. I'm not sure if I would risk it. You can kind of. A lot of keeps don't seem to be prepared for command grab. But like I said, this Jamie hasn't command grabbed once so far when he gets the drinks for it. No command grab, no die kick. His die kick is actually pretty good also. So it's definitely something he should be utilizing. We'll see how it goes. Zangief versus Jamie. Oh, it's Chun. Oh, he's playing Chun. Interesting. I thought it was... It's the same people playing. Interesting. Okay, well, I don't know. Ah. Uh. Okay, okay. <clears throat> See, the Jamie corner pressure is pretty good with the Rekkas. Oh, just jumps out. He Culkins. Ooh, EX is on you. Oh, nice, nice. Oh, bait the DP. Good punish. Let's see what it does on Wake Up. No, oh, it just shimmies. She has pretty good meaties that he's not utilizing. Oh, good block. Good punish. Cancel this super just to be safe. Better safe than sorry. Looks like the Chun is doing much better than last time. Oh, the headbutt. Hard knockdown if it's air to air. Full screen is onto you. Gets blocked and punished. Gets his drinky drink. Oh, nice. He just frame traps him. Overhead. Oh, gets hit by the jump in. Into the throw. He really likes those full screen hazans. We didn't punish the break dance. So far, it can, make, it can be kind of hard to punish break dance because you can do just the one or the two. So sometimes you think he did two and you wait and then he's safe. Just hitting him with those slows and the lightning kicks again. Oh, he's a little too far for the throw. Oh, here's the drink. Three drinks. Will he use the command throw? Tried to get the fourth, so he's a little too greedy. Oh, interesting. I don't know what that move was, but he did it. Oh, full screen has on you. Finally pays off after doing it so many times. Oh no, for Chun Li. <laughs> Air throw, nice. It's a pretty decent option against jumping people. Both try to throw, but they're a little too far. Poking with the crouch fears. He's pretty decent at drive rushing that normal to try to make it safe. But I don't know if it's safe. I think he might be able to jab it afterwards. Oh, gets two drinks. What a greedy drinker. Oh, nice. Nice anti-air. Oh, blocks that. Big punish. Ooh, nice shimmy. And he throws him afterwards just to keep him aware of the throw still. He's doing much better in neutral. He's kind of winning neutral. Oh, nice Kokokin. Oh, that wasn't the best punish, but take what you can get, right? Oh, good punish on that. That's definitely a negative. And this might win it for Salty Group. Just one more round. Full screen has on you again. He loves the full, the full screen has on you. That's something I'd probably recommend. 
But if it's working for you, then whatever, right? Okay, yeah, he just didn't need to chill. He doesn't need to do that much. So he has a life lead. He's poking with his on shoes and pokes. He just needs to keep doing that. Doesn't need to overextend because the Jamie's the one that has to do the work now. Oh, good anti air. <coughs> it's hit by that. Just dashes him back into the corner. That's crazy. What a mad lad. Another throw. He's really just keeping. Oh, it's random drive rest. Neutral jump. But Jamie can be right back into it. Oh, he didn't drink. Oh. Damn. That was nice. Good confirm. There's a pretty big difference between the first round and the last round. How's it going? How'd your matches go? Oh, I got completely 